Good evening, guys. I am your host, Infinite Child. And of course, before the night ends, your day ends, I have to give you this word. And um, I just hope everyone's day is going well. And, you know, know that you are a blessing and be a blessing unto others. I hope this word uh, encourages you. I hope this word resonates with you. And I hope this word blesses you. And, um, you know, I always have to say this word is for somebody for someone and it is for me as well and so really quickly you guys i just want to you know just remind all of us that god's grace is sufficient for each and every one of us um you know at some point one at some point in our lives um when we face difficult situations and or uh well difficult situations and uh sometimes you know it can make us you know feel hopeless or um or fear and sometimes defeated you know um that can happen and and i guess it depends on how much depth the situation is or you know are the people that are involved but you know sometimes we could feel so low so low and 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 just want to give up on things but you know god's grace is sufficient and whatever predicament that we find ourselves in, um, it looks dark, gloomy, you know, and the, the, the outlook, you know, it's, it seems like there's no place to go, you know, and sometimes you don't even know how to feel, or sometimes you, you can't even, you feel like God's not there with you, but I, I want to tell you guys, you know, never underestimate God's presence um, and even, you know, the extent of God's love because it's every day. He loves us. He loves on us every day, every day. And um, God is able to, to trans to to transfer or I, I should say, um, uh, that's not even the right word. I would say, I would say transformation. Um, God is able to, you know, give us complete transformation through throughout it all. Anything that you're going through, and even your 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 mindset, even your thoughts, you know, that can quickly change. And you know, there's there's always hope, and there's no despair. Um, or, you know, there's, with God's love, we defeat all things. All things, doesn't matter what it is. And, you know, knowing that we have victory through his name. Amen. And, you know, you guys, please do not be discouraged with anything. Um, and a lot of things are going on in this world. And even, you know, things on the outside looking in, even with family members or even you know, your closest friends, uh, workplace, whatever, whatever's going on, you know, you are still victorious and God's grace is always sufficient. It's always sufficient for each and every one of us. And throughout it all, our faith is always rewarded. And that's what God is looking for. Our faith, our faith. Again, that is our, um, our currency. You know faith and we have to we have to stand faithful uh we have to stand on his word and trust his word and god is always faithful it is us that are not you know us human beings we are not faithful but god is always faithful to his word and he's faithful to each and every one of us amen and nevertheless whatever you're going through just know that god will deliver you from that always always and so again that's why we trust him we trust him in the wilderness trust him uh in unpleasant situations we trust him in situations that we cannot control we trust him when our heart is broken we trust him when uh people give up on us uh people just uh not loving on you um persons that um uh, that dislike you or even hate you and that's a strong word. I don't like to use the word hate, but, you know, sometimes that's what it is. You know, people can hate you for unknown reasons sometimes. And um, 
you know, uh, persons that have been looked over, you know, um, situations, uh, you know, there's many, many situations that, you know, everyone has gone through. Now, not necessarily what you've gone through, uh, you know, I can't fathom that, you know, some things I have not experienced and vice versa, but any and everything that you're going through, just trust God and, you know, we always have defeat and knowing that he is with us every step of the way. And so I want to leave you with this with 2 Corinthians uh, chapter 12, verse 9. My grace is, is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in your weakness, in, in, in weakness. And, you know, we have to lean on to God with all things, amen, because he is everything that we need and even things that we haven't even not ever thought about. And he always provides, amen. And so, uh, you guys, you know, we always have to prove ourselves faithful, always. And, you know, and of course, we are tested. God does test us. And he wants to know if he can trust us. He wants to know if we could uh, lean on to his word. He wants to know if we are trusting him to bring us out of any situation. And even trusting him for the desires of our hearts. Amen. And so, just a reminder for all of us, you know, God's grace is sufficient. And even in our weakness, amen, he is our strength. He is our shelter. He is our refuge. He's everything, everything, everything. You guys, I hope this word encourages you. I hope this word meets you where you are. And again, I hope this word blesses you. For all those that... um that are subscribed much gratitude and feel free to share and feel free to look over uh past content and you guys enjoy your weekend enjoy your weekend be safe and know that you are a blessing to other people you you are blessed we are blessed i will talk to you soon i love you all with the love of christ be safe